Welcome to 5 Minute Presets. Let's make a pad here. Let's start a countdown and here we go. Let's start with a wavetable. Let's see what we have over here. Let's choose, what is this? Classic with a twist. No, I think we did that one before. Uh, classy? Okay, we can make that work here. So it's got a small little LFO over here and let's bring this down to a free running. Let's drag this way down. Too fast, or maybe slower. Okay, let's give some unison here, maybe three voices. Okay, the envelope sucks. Let's bring this over here. Let's increase our attack. Maybe one second, increase the attack curve so it's fat. Okay, we're getting something right over here. Let's go to the next engine. Let's choose a sample. If it's already selected on sample, let's say... Oh, you know, I really love this one vocal one. I think it's... Oh, yeah. Okay, let's turn this off for now. Okay, it's got a random start for that sample because that would be kind of nice here. And let's go to a... You know what? Let's go to a sample and hold. Let's re-trigger this from the clock over here. Actually, you know what? Let's trigger this from the poly keyboard. Give it a little rise and fall. Actually, let's link these two. Oh god, almost three minutes. Okay, that's a cool one for this. Let's see how that is with the wavetable. Okay, that's cool. Let's go down over here to the noise here. Let's bring in something like... Was it here? Was it hardware or natural? Was it hardware? Was it Atmos? Oh, Ghost. I really like this one here. Send this to another filter. Let's turn these off. Send that small LFO. Just kind of move it on this guy. Okay, now we need to have a sub in there because we love subs. Let's go to direct out here. Let's bring this all the way down. Macro number three. Let's bring this as a sub. Something like that. Label that sub. Oh my god, two minutes. Okay, now we need to EQ the crap out of this because this is muddy as hell. So let's go with over here. Okay, now we need delays because delays always make things better. Let's do a dotted, or is it eighth note here? Let's bring this down just a little bit. Cut some here, cut some here. I get another delay. Boom, we have one minute, 46 seconds left. Quarter note's fine. Bring that up, bring that that. Let's change the fine. Oh God, we need our macros for our cutoffs here. So let's change this out to, you know what? I really like the Matrix 12 for something like this. Put our cutoff down over here. Let's make sure we can open it quite a bit. Maybe this have this kind of slightly moving that. Get some resonance here. Res. And cut. Okay, one minute to finish up our effects here. So we have, let's get a little bit of reverb here. Let's just kind of move some of these knobs so we know where it's right. Make the size a little bit bigger. Drop down the decay. Drop down this. And then for our last two, let's do our Juno 6 thing. Let's bring this halfway here. Let's change the phase on the next one. Of course, Juno 6, change the phase like this. And then boom. Okay, let's add our macro effects here. That's going to be delay. That's going to be delay. That's 15, something like that. I don't know. It's not 21 exactly, but okay. 30 seconds. Let's go to number four. Chorus Juno 6. Chorus Juno 6. Bring that all the way down. Maybe that's kind of fine right there. Something like that. Bring this up. Double click. FX. Let's fix our envelope a little bit here. 15 seconds. What's that? Let's bring this down just a little bit here. 10 seconds here. Ooh. 
Okay, pencils down, pencils down. Let's see how we did here. So, yeah, let's play some with this thing here. Okay, so what should we call this? Oh, man. The Hidden Hand. Ooh, that has a ring to it. The Hidden Hand. This one is The Hidden Hand. Okay, so if you want to download it, it's in the video description below. So, yeah, thank you for watching. We'll see you in the next one.